I had this crazy idea and um, and this is the beginning. So this could be the beginning and the end. It could be just the beginning. It could be a lot of things. For most of my life, I've suffered from dis-ease and chronic body pain. The doctors have diagnosed me with things like fibromyalgia, myofascial pain disorder. It's taken me years to realize that in order to heal, I have to start taking responsibility for the way that I feel instead of waiting for a miraculous cure. Heading out to go to Salt Lake right now. I'm super excited and also nervous. We are in Reno, Nevada. Biggest little city in the world. We are in the middle of the San Francisco Bay. We are going to Michelle's house. <laughs> and she saved my life over the past two days and she's my reconnection cure. So it was about a year and a half ago that the idea of the connection cure kind of started manifesting for me. So the way that the connection cure crystallized itself was when I realized that I wasn't alone in my loneliness. And that was like a really intense moment for me because what I realized in that moment was that the way that I isolate myself when I don't feel well, the way that I cut off when I don't want to be vulnerable, has actually made me more sick, right? So what is the cure? The cure is connection, the cure is engagement, the cure is looking at somebody and actually seeing them and sharing in a moment with them. That's what the connection cure is. So I'm going out for two reasons. One, because I actually truly want to see if by having these moments out on the road and having these conversations with strangers changes my personal body's biochemistry. What if having a conversation with a stranger actually makes you healthier. There's so many people here. Just listen. Two, can we together create a ripple effect of micro moments state by state across the country? The goal of the workshop is what changes, what becomes possible when every person walks out of that room and looks at every single individual walking by them as an opportunity to heal and change your body from the inside. I dare you to sit across from another human being and not find a moment or a way to connect on something similar. I'm in an Uber pool and I uh, was just talking about the last book I read on the plane which brought me to tears and we just had this new person enter into the car. Yes, I just got into the car and I shared the last book that I had read and it was the same book I had also read. God, is that the craziest thing? <laughs> Okay, so we're here at New Vista with my new favorite humans. And we're talking about, what are we talking about? Leading with love. I've done 17 workshops. I have been to Utah and Wyoming, and I've been to Idaho, and five different places in California, three different places in Nevada. And, you know, it's gonna keep going. I will keep going because there is nothing that's gonna stop me from doing this. So if the idea of connecting more makes you excited for yourself, for your friends, for your family, for your community, for your country, then I really hope that you'll join us on the journey of